Hi Libra, welcome to your November 2021 He Said, She Said reading. Thanks for joining us. My name is Michelle. My name's Richard. And this is for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus Signs. Libra, doing a dual reading either side can resonate, so please do keep that in mind and if you're cross-watching, either side can resonate as a Libra and that you're dealing with. Looking at your oracle cards, just quickly here, we've got the card of receive, accepting the gift. So it seems like you're, uh, if this is you Libra, remember this can be reversed, uh, it, it feels like what you're getting here, you feel pretty, pretty darn good about. Now Richard's also pulled a card. A card of confidence. So somebody's self-assured, uh, somebody is bold, somebody's taking a chance I get. And it seems like you're, uh, you're receiving this confidence and you're, you're very happy about it, that this person's coming forward. So let's take a look here, uh, Libra. We'll start with the past energy, move on to the present, near future, your advice, what's happening in your environment, hopes and fears, the potential outcome, what's hidden or unexpected, and the potential, out oh, sorry, the, uh, the overall energy for the reading. Okay, past, present, future, advice, environment, hopes and fears, outcome, what's hidden, and the overall energy. Let's see what the overall energy for the month is. Six of swords in reverse. Okay. All right. I'm getting a sense around this of staying where you're at. Now, okay, I'm getting kind of like accepting help. I'm not sure what that is yet. Okay. So we've got the five of pentacles in reverse. So this person might have broken up from somebody and now they're recovering from that. Mm. But you know, they're gaining their confidence back. Mm. I think they uh, they were lacking confidence. Now they're now they're feeling more confident. Mm. Okay, my spirit guide is saying this is a return. Someone coming back. Oh, right. okay, all right. So it could be an ex. Someone that you you've been missing. Oh, all right. Mm. Judgment. Yeah. Reconciliation, right? Yeah, I feel like uh, having reconciliation on the mind. Mm. Uh, when will I see this person again? Mm -hmm. A page of pentacles in the reverse so there could have been a false start uh, a, a situation where you two got together and then didn't work out and now they're now they're thinking maybe they want to come back mm. the hierophant i feel this is the person strong earth energy guys could be a, a, a virgo a taurus or capricorn uh, coming in it feels like this person is returning, is returning um, confidently. All right. Yeah, look at that with the three of pentacles here as well. So somebody is, is wanting to come back now and be, be cooperative. Perhaps what happened was um, there was a miscommunication or a misunderstanding about what each of you wanted. Mm. I, th I think in the end, I, I think you, I think what you wanted was something traditional, and this person may not have wanted something traditional. But now they're kind of changing their mind and and wondering if maybe they they are ready for something like that. You know what I'm getting? That this person is looking for some kind of security because they're feeling unanchored. Mm, that could be true too. Let's see. The Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, Libra. I've got this as you. Yeah, somebody who's independent and doing pretty well for themselves. Yeah. I think this person sees that. They see what they're missing out on. Yeah, they see you as, as stable. They see you as having the comfortable home, uh, very uh, uh, self-sufficient. Uh, I get this as a feeling of, uh, of being alone, but uh, happy to be so. Uh, okay, all right. Yeah, we've got the seven of, seven of Pentacles in the reverse here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I get a very strong energy of this person not wanting to, to work on their own anymore, perhaps um, looking to looking to take advantage a little bit of, mm -hmm. of what you've been able to put together. Um, yeah, mm -hmm. it's not it's actually not very nice energy is, that I'm seeing here from this person. Mm -hmm. And their motivations are a little bit suspect. Yeah, I feel it's all about them. 
and what they can gain from you. They feel like a little bit of a takeout, to be honest. Mm. Let's see, advice, the Seven of Swords. Yeah, be careful of this yeah. person. Yeah, but they're, they're, they're coming in with a strategy. Yeah, it's like um, receiving, accepting the gift. Well, is this a gift to you or are you giving the gift? I think you're giving the gift to this person. Or is it just a Trojan horse? They're, they're take, they seem to be a taker. Hmm. Yeah, we've got the three of wands in the reverse here as advice. Yeah, I, I think. Uh, yeah, I'm wondering if if what they're leading, what they're giving to you, or what, what wanting to offer you, is actually going to lead to disappointment for you, Virgo. Mm -hmm. I feel like this. A Libra, person, sorry. Yeah, the, and you could be dealing with a Virgo. I get very strong. Mm very strong Virgo vibes but it doesn't have to be it could be any earth energy but mm. look at all of that earth mm. Mm. and what I'm getting around them is this feeling of um, insecurity in their life frustration um, and, and wanting something to fix their life uh, they lack in confidence they lack that uh, they're looking for someone to pump them up, you know, mm. to raise them up on that podium. Uh, they're looking for uh, idolization, admiration, and they're disappointed that they're not receiving it. I don't feel that you're giving it to them, Libra. All right. In the environment, we've got the Nine of Cups. Mm. There's, a ha there's happiness here, there's, there's bliss, there's contentment. Okay, this is you. I feel that this is you being comfortable with what you have, where you're at. Well, the other way of looking at Nine of Cups is this person what get trying to get what they want, getting their wish. Well, it's because you're in this state that that's why they're coming in, thinking, oh, you know, I wouldn't mind a bit of that. Yeah. Okay, yeah, so we've got the star in reverse here in the environment as well. Yeah, I think it's like Michelle was saying, this person wants to be confident. Mm. They, they feel like they have to perhaps be show some bravado. Mm. Uh, and it, it could be just fake confidence mm. that they're showing here. Because I think they don't see themselves as being worthy of you. They're suffering a whole lot of disappointment. I get disappointment after disappointment after disappointment. I feel like this person is coming in as like a friend. Uh, they, it might be an ex, but uh, it feels like they're coming back as like a friend. Uh, they want to be around you. They just want to know that uh, you still think a lot of them. Mm -hmm. uh, for this person, it seems to be important to be seen as the star, but they're not seeing themselves as the star. Uh, they actually have a lot of uh, unhappiness, dissatisfaction in their life. Hopes and fears, four of pentacles in reverse. Well, that's the thing. I think that um, you've released this. It seems like it's an X coming back, guys. Well, I know that four of pentacles in the reverse, I see that as being more of a fear, a fear of losing money. To, to this person. To this person. It could be that, but that, that's what I mean. I feel like you're releasing them, mainly because you value what you have now, uh, what you've built up on your own, you've this independence, you're valuing that over whatever this person is giving to you. It could, it could be that, you know, you, you start, both of you started out with nothing. And this person hasn't been able to, to make that, that bankroll that you've mm -hmm. been able to make. Mm. I, I kind of get a strong feeling of that, you know, this young couple starting out and mm. then they, that, you know, it, it, times are really hard. They they break up. One person goes out, be successful. The other person can't really manage that su success. And now they're coming back to you, mm. saying, "Well, you look, you've been successful now, and uh, I, I'd like to, I'd like to ride ride on the gravy train, mm. please." Mm. Yeah, the yeah, it's uh, the Ace of Wands in reverse again. It's that lack of confidence. Yeah, they fear that they don't have it anymore. Yeah. Um, I feel like they're, they're suffering a lot of disappointment in life and they're, they're going around seeking validation. Mm -hmm. What's hidden here is the five of wands in reverse. The, the, what's hidden here is you could care less about this person anymore. That's the thing. They're coming into you hoping that uh, you'll give them what they need, that they want to they take this from you. But you're valuing yourself 
and what you've built for yourself I get high levels of self-worth around you Libra uh, look you, you're you're receiving all the gifts here from the universe why because you've done the work on yourself you've you've reached this stage of contentment of fulfillment of being happy where you're at and it's because of that you're receiving gifts but gifts from the universe not from this person mm. now this person is seeing you be successful and they're thinking oh gosh all right well things are not going too well for me they're seeing you as this confident person and so they want to get a bit of that confidence and they hope it's going to brush off on them by being around you libra yeah what's hidden here we've got the four of swords in the reverse so, so there's been a you know i get a lot of laziness mm -hmm. here on the part of this person it's kind of like you have a story of the the ant and the grasshopper uh, you're the you're the uh, you're, you're the ant virgo and this person's the grasshopper who comes mm -hmm. who, who's, who's been lazy hasn't been storing their their food for the winter mm. and they, they come to you asking asking for the asking for some food you're the one who's been doing all the work mm. and and this person here that they've been uh, lazing around not uh, not being what they need to be but hoping to to ride on your coattails and you probably haven't seen this person for a while the two of wands mm. well it says it's going to be your choice here uh, Libra what you do uh, this person seems to be um, well you know what I think on one hand you might have hoped that this person came back to you cap in hand yeah, yeah just as a um, just kind of as a mm. yeah it's kind of like a just desserts kind yeah. of situation yeah vindication vindication yeah you feel like ah oh, yeah i knew I you'd knew be you'd back know, i knew you'd be back i knew you'd be back and yeah here they come oh, mm -hmm. libra mm -hmm. yeah a knight of pentacles in reverse so not <laughs> a lot of negativity on this side and uh, a lot of negative outcomes here i, I think yes yeah, it's one of those things that yes i want you to come back but yeah, then i want to be able to tell you no <laughs> yes exactly yeah, yeah. Let's see, I'm going to uh, pull a card from the Oracle of Visions, uh, Libra, and uh, let's see, before we go to the extended, if this is your story, please do join us in the extended, the link is down below, be about a 30 minute reading, Richard will be doing Lenormand, I'll be doing uh, tea leaves as well, I'll be clarifying everything on the table with the tarot. Uh, so please do join us again the link is down below if you'd prefer a personal reading by me you can email me gypsyinsights at gmail.com or you can go to my etsy store and purchase directly there if you are a member of my band of gypsies of course you can access the extended readings at the top tier level if you'd like to join and watch the extendeds here on youtube ways that you can do that by clicking on the join button or looking in the box for more information uh, Libra, please do leave us a comment down below. Love to hear from you guys. Press that thumbs up. Take a moment now. Really appreciate that if you wouldn't mind. And if you're a newcomer, please do subscribe. I'd love to have you. What we will be talking about in the extended reading, let me grab one more. That's rest and meditation. I feel like you've been, you in the time apart between visits by this person, let's just call it that, it feels like you have uh, taken the time to get comfortable with yourself uh, and your situation and you're receiving the gifts more gifts are coming to you as a result of finding happiness and contentment with your own situation this other person seems to be wanting to avoid that they're avoiding being alone avoiding um, the disappointment of their life gosh let's get one more card and let's see what we will be talking about in the extended reading here uh, Libra what will we be talking about in the extended reading for Libra please okay okay uh, this is yin and yang energy if again I feel it's all about you finding peace and balance in your life they get, they're going to come back here, but they're going to find you quite content. Yeah, I think they're going to be disappointed yeah. in the result. 
They, they may be expecting you to be like welcoming them back with mm, open, open arms, arms but I don't, but think I, don't I don't feel that that's the case but there is this little bit of smugness that I'm picking up with this nine of cups and receiving yeah. uh, that this person is kind of going to come back here and you, you're just going to have that little bit of look on your face I mm -hmm. think uh, Libra all right so uh, wishing you the best with this uh, please take care and we'll see you in part two bye Libra good luck